Hey everyone, what's up? It's Agent Nemitz, and welcome back today to another episode of NBA 2K19, my career. We are here today. Um, oh yeah, I forgot. We got some messages. I didn't open them because we got three. So, Corey Harris. Uh, oh, okay. <laughs> Same thing as he always said. Keep trying those flashy dunks. Uh, I'm going to answer the opposite thing. You wish you could pull off my style. What style is that? Depressing clown or homeless former... Wow. Okay. Uh, ben Simmons. Oh. Shanko. <laughs> so Ben Simmons is our friend now. That's pretty cool. Uh, something else that's cool? Look at that. Look at that screen right there. What does that tell you? That tells you that we got a cat breaker. And also, that we are um, we're very good at getting fans. <laughs> and that we are most likely a starter now. I wasn't last episode or last... Well, yeah, I wasn't last episode or last game I played. But I probably will get a cutscene and we're a starter now. This right here, upgrading our passing, is so important. It goes from 68 to 70. That's like huge. It's really huge. Our steals goes up a bit. And our block and shot contest go up a bit, which is good. But as you can see, for some reason we don't level up to 89 overall. What's the deal with that? I don't know. It's pretty dumb. But hey, you can only ask for so much. Um, here's our badge progression. Uh, we got, uh, what was it? We got pickpocket, finally, on bronze, and it maxes out there. Um, ankle breaker, we're gonna probably unlock that in a few minutes, so give us a second. Um, super cool. Let's see what else we got here. You can see we've gotten a little more in quick reflexes. Limitless, and then everything else that's here because we've been working, we've been grinding. So, yeah, now let's get into what you guys clicked on this video for. In this video, um, obviously, from the title and thumbnail, I'm gonna teach you how to use the team practice facility, um, it, like how I use it, but it's also like how to use it the right way and how to use it efficiently you know I really struggled to say efficiently right there <laughs> I don't know why but anyways so we're gonna use the team practice facility I'm gonna show you how I use it uh, how to use it well oh boy so this is the team right here hey guys listen up I got a special guest here with me Whoa. This guy is courageous, outrageous, and oh, spontaneous. Man. He's going to come talk to you guys about winning. Superman. Hey, don't get hysterical. Just blame me for this miracle. Right on it. You guys ever heard of BCT? Uh, yeah. No, you haven't, because I just made it up. Oh. Barbecue chicken theory. Opponent is barbecue chicken. I know you guys like to eat. Take the opponent. You bite it. You lick your fingers. You win. You don't know what that means, but you'll figure it out. All right? Have a great practice. You. Come here. Me? Oh. Yeah, you. This is AI, right? Yeah, this is him. What's, 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 up, what's up, Shaq? Don't say what's up, Shaq, to me, buddy. Okay. See that? That's how many I got. How many you got, Barkley? Zero. Listen, I do the talking. I'm going to be watching you, all right? Oh, okay. I'm going to be places you'd never expect me to be. You'll be places on, okay? Yeah, all right. You going to say barbecue chicken. You want me to say barbecue chicken? Alert. Uh, so, okay, uh, alert. Barbecue chicken alert. Barbecue chicken alert. All right, now walk that way and keep saying it. It'll mean something later. Bar barbecue chicken alert. We can hear alert. you. Keep going. Barbecue chicken alert. Say it a little louder. Uh, barbecue chicken alert. Barbecue That's chicken AI. alert. Barbecue chicken alert. Bar barbecue chicken alert. Yes. Take it to my office. Barbecue chicken alert. <laughs> keep saying it. <laughs> barbecue chicken, chicken alert. alert. I can't hear you. Barbecue chicken <laughs> alert. What type of chicken? Barbecue chicken alert. How many sides? What's up, AI? Okay. That was really weird and funny. <laughs> um, I was not expecting that, like, at all. So, okay. <laughs> Shaq just uh, 
came and hung out with us. So I don't know what that means, but whatever. All right, I'm going to show you how to use the team practice facility. So you get four drills to use, as everyone knows, if you if you use the team practice facility. Now, um, it only takes 5,000 to unlock one of your badges to bronze. And it takes 15,000 for silver. And then I believe that it's like... 50,000 for gold I'm not sure but um that's beside the point anyways so I would recommend using the team practice facility to unlock all of your badges to bronze and that means basically what I just said no <laughs> um to unlock everything to bronze using um the team practice facility of course focus on your primary badges which are labeled in here and you can see you have four drills remaining. Um, of course, focus on those. I haven't focused on Teardropper or Up and Under Specialist because I don't use those in a game. Um, I might start using Teardropper more just so I can unlock the badge. But um, the team, the practice for it, he like, I don't know if it's a glitch for me, but it wasn't working, the controls. So anyways, uh, unlock your badges to bronze using the team practice facility just because it's easy. And that doesn't mean don't do stuff to get them unlocked in a game, but focus on unlocking all your badges to bronze first in the team practice facility. It'll really help. Uh, and there's certain drills that are just impossible to do. Like, um, Limitless is pretty hard if you're not, like, a sharpshooter. So, like me, I, prob I make, like, 7 out of 20 on a good day. So that's really hard to do. <laughs> Uh, another one that was really hard to do was pickpocket. It was impossible for me because I'm not quick. So I couldn't get in front of the people. Well, I mean, I'm quick, but I'm not, like, amazingly quick. And they're ball handlers, as you can see. So it's really hard to get in front of point guards when you're a small forward. Another time to use the team practice facility is when you're really close to unlocking the next tier of a badge. So, for instance, I'm really close to getting silver ankle breaker. So what do I do? I click on it. If I've never done the drill before, I might read what it does. Um, and then I do it. And it's just pretty much that simple. Uh, and, you know, if you've been in the practice facility before, you know how it works. And you just got to score, obviously. I don't know how that went in. But anyways, yeah, it's basically that. You just do whatever the drill entitles. And, yeah, it's pretty much that simple. Oh man, but yeah, I'm not gonna force you guys to watch me grinding for some of these, just because it might be a little boring. And uh, yeah, so that's what that's that. So coming back, I got two stars, which gives you 400 XP. Three stars gives you 700 XP, and one star gives you 100 XP. But as you saw, I got enough to unlock Silver Ankle Breaker, and it actually maxes out at silver, uh, which is kind of sad for me personally because I love to break ankles. But I break a lot of ankles in a game already, so I'm okay with it being silver. Um, yeah, and then from there, I'm just going to work on leveling up all my badges because you know it only took one to do that and uh now i'm gonna move on to the next one now of course if there's something that you really use a lot and you really want it to level up so like for instance um for me i use a lot of posterizer because i like to drive to the basket um posterizer and relentless finisher are key badges for me because they really help me to finish strong around the rim especially in dunks which are also always awesome so, if I really wanted to progress this further, I might just come into the team practice facility and spend all of my drills on that specific badge. And that might help a lot too. So, like, if I really wanted posterizer, I would just come in and do every drill on that. Um, so, that is another way to really progress one badge a lot. But, like I said, I would really, really recommend using 
um, using it to unlock all of your badges on bronze first just because some of them max out at bronze like you know you can see that um my deep range dead eye defensive stopper pick dodger and why do i have two pick dodgers what in the world what do you see this oh no it's pickpocket pick dodger gotcha so my pickpocket pick dodger deep range dead eye and defensive stopper all cap out at bronze i believe i have at least two more that cap out at bronze so that means that you know it's it's um useful to at least do some of them especially ones that are important like defensive stoppers incredibly important deep range dead eye if you're shooting threes in a game that's important pick dodger is very important which is very easy to unlock also and then pickpocket is important if you like to get steals. And we just leveled up our steals. So that's really going to be helpful for me. Um, yeah, so I'm going to finish doing the rest of my badges. It might be a time lapse form. But then we're going to head into our next game. So yeah, I am excited for that. All you gotta do is push B. It's not a control that shows up. It is just when that screen shows up, you just push B and it goes away. So you can just get out of that vast, fast. information was helpful to you and that uh, you can get the most out of your team practice facility every time you go in there uh now the games i played off camera we both lost why i have no idea i think i might have had off games i don't know but like look at look at our look at us look at us 
Just look. I didn't do bad. And like even in this one. Well, Blake scored more than me, but still. I got a triple-double in this one. Isn't that crazy? I don't understand. It's all right, though. Um, I don't know how many losses we have on our record. I really don't care. Tonight, we are playing against the Toronto Raptors. I hope our fate will not be the same as it was then. Uh, let's just head into it and find out. Let's just wear these classic away jerseys and head into it. Good evening, sports fans. This is 2K Sports. Ernie Johnson, Shaquille O'Neal, Kenny Smith. Tonight, we'll see the Toronto Raptors playing against the Detroit Pistons. Well, for Detroit, playing above 500 in the last few weeks, not bad. They'd like to do better. We'll see if they can add a win tonight. And one of the stars in our upcoming game, spend a little time with one of our stars right here, Shaq. How was your meeting with AI? All I'll say is, because snitches get stitches, is AI made some questionable decisions when he was young. We all have. I can relate. Wow, that's deep. That's all you're getting from me, Ernie. Mm. Lips are sealed. Wow. No details on your bad decisions? Mm -hmm. And throw away the key. Mm. What? AI. He definitely had some hard times. He had some drama, and he fought his way into the league. But it seems to be behind him now. But Shaq's not telling us, so I'm not 100% sure it's behind us because we sent him in there to get information. He comes back here, and he doesn't and he won't give say us anything. anything. <laughs> way, way to work. That was, a that was valuable for our show. <laughs> for you to go talk to AI and then come time. back and say, oh, I don't know, didn't say anything. Send me next time. I will. I'll send you to talk to AI. I'll sing like <laughs> Luther Vandross. <laughs> or maybe we'll send Kevin Harlan. Okay. Hey, you make sure you guys get a good warm-up out there. AI, you ready? Uh, for game? Yeah, of course. About to go get warmed up. No, I mean, are you ready? <laughs> yeah, coach, I'm ready. Wait, uh, for, for what? You starting tonight. I'm starting tonight? Mm-hmm. You starting tonight. Wow. Yo, that's hard to believe, man. <laughs> well, you've earned it, AI. Look, you've proven yourself beyond a shadow of doubt that you belong in this league. It's time to take it to the next level. Hey, coach, I, I don't know what to say. I mean, I've been waiting for this a long time. <laughs> Thank you. I, I won't let you down. Oh, I know you won't. Get out there and shoot around. Proud of you, AI. Well, guys, it finally happened. I, Agent Nemitz, am a starter again. That's so awesome. We're the key matchup against Kawhi Leonard. I kind of forgot that he was on this team, by the way. I know I'm really scared now. But anyways, <laughs> so uh, apparently we're the key matchup. We're a starter now. Oh, it's so exciting. That cutscene was pretty cool. Matching up against Kawhi Leonard right here. Pointing at the back of our jersey because we're hype. Oh, guys, I'm so excited. I, we're finally out here for a tip. And Reggie Jackson is the starting point guard again. Praise be. That's exciting. Okay, Drummond. Or Griffin. We got to do this right. Oh, we're doing it right. Oh, jeez. Wow, I got fouled. If that's how it's going to be, Kawhi, you're going to be fouled out in, like, the early third. Like, very early. Holy cow. All right. Let's do this. All right. Get a little assist off the bat. Kawhi Leonard is reaching, like, bad. And he's also trying to take us in the post. Uh, I don't know how I feel about that. Defensive effort right there showing up. Here's a train. Oh baby. That's good. And it's a little fast break scoring. Get some fans in Toronto. The neighbors of our NBA team, I don't know. Drummond and finds him. The pass to A train. Drummond trying to get him. Quiet Leonard slacking on defense right there. Oh baby. All right, guys, so we're getting the start that we wanted. Oh, baby. We're doing good so far. Have seven of our 13 points. And... Or seven of our 15 points. And we're, uh... We are have over-doubled their score. We're doing very good so far. Let's keep it up. He was about a lot more than that. He's got serious skills down low. Mine. Thank you. Get him, Drummond. Woo, baby. 
That was very nice. Mine again. Oh my gosh. Kawhi Leonard cannot post us up right now. We're just beasting and feasting on this man. Refuse the screen. Pass to Drummond anyways. Ba-boom. My rebound. There you go, Drummond. Oh. What? What am I supposed to do? I was on my way out right as they were speaking. And I passed it out. I did everything as fast as I could. This is so dumb. Oh, here we go. Here we go. Easy money. Mid-range money, that is. Alright, guys. Getting subbed in the second. Got nine minutes to play. Got nine minutes to play a little. I didn't realize they have Danny Green now, too. Mine. Thank you. Holy. Get him. Oh, baby. Getting flashy on him. I see you. That wasn't a travel at all. Trust me. Get that out of here. Come on, now. What do you think is happening? Valanchunas isn't covering me either. Come on, man. Let's go. Give me the steal. Blake time. Let's go. Let's go. Whew, I'm getting angry. Alright, guys. Going into half. Up by 10. Doing pretty good on everything except scoring. Not gonna lie. Which is the exact opposite of what I want to do. David. Thank you, Kevin. Well, you were a key facilitator for your team in the first half. How rewarding is it for you when the offense is that smooth? Yeah, yeah, you know, it's, it's great. It's, uh, I mean, there's nothing better than bringing out the best in your teammates. Tonight, they've been moving really well. You know, guys just setting screens, and, and they made it easy for me to get them good looks. And you knew what to do when you got those looks in the first half. Kevin? All right, David, thank you. We'll be back after halftime for the start of the third quarter. All right, guys. So apparently Kawhi Leonard has 22 points. When I was in guarding him, he only had, like, four. So I don't know what happened, but that should not have happened. That shouldn't have happened either. What in the heck? Give it to me. Draw on the foul. That's Kawhi's fourth. That's how we get rid of his 22 points right there. That was nice. Let's let's do that some more. Oh baby, let's go. We lost Kawhi Leonard there. Let's go. Finally get another three to drop. Holy cow! Let's go. Splashing trays. Green releasing. Bang, another green. Let's go. Bang. Let's go. We ain't done yet. So, guys, we walk away with the win. Oh, good stuff. Very good stuff. Oh, yeah. 12 point dub. On the road. Against the Toronto Raptors, I believe in the power rankings, they were like number one. So we technically just beat the number one team in the, team in the NBA tonight. It's pretty sweet. Are we going to be talked to? No. Okay, good. <laughs> so, okay. Let's see our progression on our badges and such. Late game clutch shot. Shaf. Quick reflexes, okay. Well, wow, that was it. Are you serious? Well, I could have swore we got some mid-range dead eye stuff. I didn't see much of it in there. It's fine. We still got twenty-five thousand. I'll take that. Oh, baby, look at that. Fans earned thirteen thousand. Good game. Man, I am hungry. You know what I'm saying? Like, 
Here's the like guy I'm looking for, AI. Minutes. Yo, what's up, man? I uh, got you lined up for an interview, if that's okay. Oh, yeah, let's do it. Oh, perfect, good luck. Hey, Shaq here. Watching tonight, I thought your ability to create for others was the key ingredient. Was that the idea, come? Well, actually, when I'm playing out there, I actually try not to think of, uh, about anything. You know, when I got a clear mind and I get more of a zen feeling, and the game comes naturally at that point. So uh, I just try to focus in on passing, and that's when I start second-guessing everything, and everything kind of just falls apart. So I was happy I could make some plays, you know, set some guys up, and, you know, hopefully the fans enjoyed it too. Did you say zen? Phil Jackson's going to like that. Back to you, Ernie. Well, guys, it was another great game. Had some good stats. Won the game, which is always a positive. Uh, I realized the key to us winning is me getting assists more than scoring, unfortunately. So if I want badge progression, then I probably should not focus on wins. Personally, that's what I believe. But if I want wins, then we need to focus on assists. So, yeah. That's how that works. As far as I can tell, at least. Um, yeah, we're doing pretty good on everything. I was surprised we only got like 9% for that cat breaker. It's like, wow, that's real slow. <laughs> uh, that's okay, though. We're still going to be grinding. Uh, hit 99 overall this year. Grinding to get there. I hope you enjoyed this episode. If you did, leave a like for me. Subscribe if you're new or haven't subscribed already. And make sure you come on back now for the next episode where we... Uh, we just keep playing some 2K. Uh, I'm probably going to play this Cleveland game off camera and then this one off camera. And we're going to play the televised Rockets game on camera. That's my plan. Beyond that, we're not going to worry about it. Uh, if you have any ideas about what we, what we should play after that, uh, if you want to see anything between the Rockets and the Warriors, any of those three games, let me know. Beyond that... I hope you enjoyed this episode. If you did, leave a like for me. Subscribe if you're new or haven't subscribed already. And I will see you in the next episode. AI, just wanted to say I'm really happy to finally have you on our starting lineup. Thanks, coach. Looks like Reggie Jackson's pretty excited about it, too. But yeah, subscribe if you're new or haven't subscribed already. And I will see you in the next episode. So take care. Have a great day. And bye-bye.